Since being commissioned, Chafee has deployed to the 3rd, 4th, 5th, and 7th Fleet AORs. Most recently, she's conducted counter-drug operations off the coast of South America and operated with the Ronald Reagan Strike Group in the 7th Fleet AOR. So the ship is named after John Hubbard Chafee. As a warrior, he fought in World War II and in Korea. And as a statesman, he served as the senator from Rhode Island, the governor of Rhode Island, and the secretary of the Navy. All different capacities of service to the country. John Chafee, having been a uh, former SecDav uh, governor and senator, uh, obviously felt that there was a call to service. And I think that carries over into Chafee as a ship. Many of our people, in fact, all of our crew has answered the call to service. And we are honored to follow in the steps of, of great men and great people like John Chafee by continuing our service. I think that's important as Americans to understand our heritage and our history, and especially as uh, sailors. We can't understand the way forward without understanding where we came from. The commissioning anniversary of a ship is always important for the crew because it takes, it provides the crew an opportunity to reflect on the ship's namesake. He has a lot of heroic and great attributes that I think are a part of the ship. A lot of it resides in the strength of character amongst the sailors, the diversity of the crew, and their ability to see different points of view, and the spirit of teamwork. One department by itself cannot make this ship run, so in order for the ship to move, we all need each other to execute on our plans and where we're going. So anything from engineering to combat systems, without engineering, there could be no combat system. Without combat systems, there could be no security for the ship. So as a whole, we do well together. This crew is one of the most high-performing crews that I've ever seen. Um, they buy into the plan, and the uh, team aspect around here, the teamwork attitude, is, uh, is second to none. But all, all three, the wardroom, the chief's mess, and the blue jackets around the ship, they integrate well, and there's a teamwork lean on the attitude. Reload! It's, a, it's an honor for me to be here, because somebody has to do it. The ship has to sail, and without the people on it, to, for somebody to make that sacrifice, there could be no freedom. <laughs>